So Matt Damon's got from Jason Bourne to becoming a cyborg kicking ass. This is Alicia. Directed by Neil Blomkamp, who has directed District 9, and I did like District 9, but this movie was awesome. I like this movie even more. So Matt Damon is Max living on Earth, the year 2154. Earth is very polluted, overpopulated, and people are sick. And the, have, the wealthy elite have moved to a space station in the sky called Elysium. It's Paradise, where you have this machine that can magically heal you, and life up there is great. The air is clean and everything, and life on Earth sucks. And Max has always dreamed about ending up in Elysium, and he is an ex-con. He he stole some cars, and he is now on probation for doing that. His main job is he does maintenance for the security robots that are on Earth. Helps build them, I think. And events happen in his life that make it so he now he has to go to Elysium for health reasons. And the movie gets really good with action suspense when he turns himself into a cyborg in order to get the power to break into Elysium. That is cool. You have Jodie Foster as Delacorte. She is like the Secretary of Defense of Elysium. She runs things up there and she wants to gain control of the space station and she's a pretty good villain but the real big badass villain in this movie is Cougar played by Shalto Copley, the main star of District 9 and now he's back. He was really badass in this. He was awesome. <laughs> he's like one of the best parts in this movie. He's definitely like the main nemesis to Max considering both of them are cyborgs. That is just so awesome. And he has a sword. That is just great. You got Alice Brega who is Max's love interest and she's pretty good in the movie. William Fitzner is in this movie as Max's boss at his job and he was pretty good good and we got Farhan Tahir as the president of Elysium and for what role he had he was pretty good in the movie and the movie is great got a lot of action a lot of suspense great direction great acting it's just Everything about this movie was awesome, fantastic, and it just it reminded me much of Mad Max too, because which is funny because considering Matt Damon's character name is Max, so that was very cool, and it's just such a good movie. And giving this an eleven out of ten, really did like this movie. Definitely check this movie out. Right there, top three favorites with Star Trek and Pacific Rim. <laughs> 